When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. All right, guys, so today, we'll be focusing on the box squat. It's such a great tool for building squats, understanding the positioning in squats, Great for beginners, great for um, people who already know how to squat, but to get more explosive, to get that start, coming back here, that pause, and really understanding how to use those glutes, bring those glutes, hamstrings, into the movement of squats. Now, you go heavy on these, right? This is like real work. This is like real life shit right here, dude. Like seriously, dude. Like, you gotta like go all in or go home. All right? So I'm about to go all in, like right now. I just imagine like pulling out with a shitload of weight and sliding back and I fell, bounced on this, the weight bounced on me, my spine just compressed and I'm just like that. I think about death a lot when I work out. Bruh. that G fuel hydration a spin we want that, that strawberry lemonade we want, we want that girl to taste like strawberry lemonade you feel me? you're gonna be thirsty you might as well be thirsty for some strawberry lemonade and not some basic bitch ass water okay look at that look, look at that look how convenient this is stop, stop. Shake it up. Uh-uh-uh. Thank you, thank you. OJ didn't do it. Oh! Oh my god. What's up, you wanna try this? Some good shit. You gonna try this. Try this. Drink that. Drink that. Give me that. Yeah. Oh shit! Nice. Yeah, some good shit. Right there, that's the man right there. I don't know who the fuck that is. That's the man right there. <laughs> I'm gonna have to uh, disinfect the lid. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't expect him to go like raw dog my drink. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to that. that. Like I don't really listen to what's the name Scott Travis Scott, but that Drake Travis Scott song go hard. That shit go hard. I love the beat changes that Drake does. This the new dance right here. Right here, right here. You do your shit, you know how you do like that. You do your shit, you be like, hey. Yeah! <laughs> I call that the what's good. <laughs> the what's good. <laughs> that shit gonna be lit, bro. You gonna make a dance to that shit. You gonna make a whole video, bro. You just gonna go in the garage. You gonna... All right, let's do this. So like I said, the two compound, two compounds, I might do three accessories instead of two accessories, and then uh, two uh, performance work. Climate. So what we're gonna do? I'm gonna superset them with my play on metric. I'm gonna apply metric to be three vertical jumps.
back to the feeling of heavier weight. I'm more comfortable squatting than just going for a, going for a squat. I don't know why, I guess it's just because I have something, you know, I have a point of lowness, just about 90 degrees, about. Then I got these to protect me just in case I can't get it, I'll just, I'll just make it drop. Scott songs. Like, yeah, yeah, it's lit! Like, got fucking back tuning in the background, screaming random shit. That's what I hate about it. I don't know, that's what I do. I don't like that. It's annoying. It's just too much. Like, it's just, it's just fine without that. It's lit! Yeah. Fortnite, Tekken, Dragon Ball Fighters, Rainbow Six, Call of Duty. You name it, I game it. Twitch.tv slash MP Aftermath. Make sure you come to my streams. Guess what? Uh, don't sweat the technique because Garage Gym live streams are starting soon. Don't miss out. today was five sets of three explosive and then a set of one so we set with the fly right here. now we're gonna do something else today in that same concept of shoulder presses all right two sprints right here keeping those arms bent we go right after so we're conditioning those shoulders for endurance, and also create mobility as we do a strength movement. around like eight to ten seconds. You're asking to run. Or are you like shoulder press is so light bro? Get games. It's because I'm trying to keep my body hollowed. I'm not trying to be arch. I'm trying to be right here and try to work on that mobility to keep my abs tight the whole time and actually do a legit shoulder press and not some back arch standing incline bench press. I think when it comes to being an athlete or training like an athlete, understanding performance is to understand whatever you're doing in the gym, how does that transfer into what you're doing? And I always think about that when I'm in the gym. Like, all right, what does this movement do? What does it work? How can I utilize this or change up this movement to be more, you know, obtainable of, of a feeling on the on the field, on the court, or whatever. How do I transfer this to that movement? You know, if I'm doing a jump, if I'm doing a step, if I'm reacting a certain way, what will help me while doing this go over? And that's something to keep in mind. You know, don't just, you know, I understand we love the gym. Sometimes we do things blindly. But when you think about things at a bigger aspect, such as that, it will really help you. And without even, you just think about that, and you'll understand where, where you'll be in time. Like, I did weightlifting. 
I do bodybuilding type stuff starting out. But I still thought about, when I was training for the NFL, I still thought about, all right, even though I'm doing this bodybuilding style training, you know, these certain movements still help me develop speed, strength, um, um, uh, jumping abilities, you know, the tightness and stuff came, yes, that came. The mobility kind of shrunk down, but I still, it, it, it's better to work on the mobility than to work on the strength, right? It's easy, you, you, can, you can break down yourself to work on mobility and still keep the strength, but if you already got the mobility and stuff, it's hard to get the strength. You can't just get the strength out of nowhere. So that's a great thing, that's a great way to think about when you're training, just to, just to throw in. First rep was to get warm up, now we're gonna start. What we wanna do is a slow descend, right? And an explosive, explosive push. So we're gonna slow down, gain that strength, that, that, uh, that eccentric motion, and then I'm gonna explode up. We're gonna do that about five times. jump to the dumbbell and then we're gonna do an overhead snatch right we got five sets two reps one snatch with the right hand one snatch with the left hand I appreciate y'all watching this video. I'm spoiling this shit right now. You see the pump on me, bro? You see the pump? Yo, I'm killing it right now. Make sure you like and subscribe. Damn, so the bars been me? Boy, you, you already know, you boy. This is about a thousand. I got about, I think I got about a rack mm -hmm. on this boy. Easy. You already know what it is. Catch you guys later. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny.